Chapter 15 And there came a messenger to David, saying, The hearts of the men of Israel are after Absalom. And David said unto all his servants that were with him at Jerusalem, Arise, and let us flee, for we shall not else escape from Absalom. Make speed to depart, lest he overtake us suddenly, and bring evil upon us, and smite the city with the edge of the sword. And the king's servants said unto the king, Behold, thy servants are ready to do whatsoever my lord the king shall appoint. And the king went forth, and all his household after him, and the king left ten women which were concubines to keep the house. And the king went forth and all the people after him, and tarried in a place that was far off. And all his servants passed on beside him, and all the Carathites, and all the Pelophites, and all the Gittites, six hundred men which came after him from Gath passed on before the king. Then said the king to Ittai the Gittite, Wherefore goest thou also with us, return to thy place, and abide with the king, for thou art a stranger and also an exile. Whereas thou camest but yesterday, should I this day, make thee go up and down with us, seeing I go whither I may, return thou, and take back thy brethren. Mercy and truth be with thee. But Ittai answered the king and said, As the Lord liveth, and as my lord the king liveth, surely in what place my lord the king shall be, whether in death or life, even there also will thy servant be. And David said to Ittai, Go and pass over. And Ittai the Gittite passed over, and all his men, and all the little ones that were with him. And all the country wept with a loud voice, and all the people passed over. The king also himself passed over the brook Kidron, and all the people passed over toward the way of the wilderness. And lo, Zadok also and all the Levites were with him, bearing the ark of the covenant of God. And they set down the ark of God, and Abiathar went up, until all the people had done passing out of the city. And the king said unto Zadok, Carry back the ark of God into the city, if I shall find favor in the eyes of the Lord, he will bring me again and show me both it and his habitation. But if he thus say, I have no delight in thee, behold, here am I, let him do to me as seemeth good unto him. The king said also unto Zadok the priest, Art not thou a seer? Return into the city in peace, and your two sons with you, Ahimaaz thy son, and Jonathan the son of Abiathar. See, I will tarry in the plain of the wilderness, until there come word from you to certify me. Zadok therefore and Abiathar carried the ark of God again to Jerusalem, and they tarried there.